Hey guys, it's me, Clay Connor here for a different type of video. And today's video, um, I was originally planning to do a VHS DVD Blu-ray 4K Ultra, Ultra HD update for today, but it, but today I've gotten so, but over the past two weeks and say I've gotten so many movies that I just decided I'm going to set, put, make something special, um, for this, for this, for this one, this is this one's going to be a Criterion Collection and Kino Lorber Studio Classics um, DVD, Blu-ray, and 4K Ultra HD disc update. So yeah, and basically, um, during this week and during this week and earlier this month, I've gotten some Blu-ray of DVD from CriterionCollection.com's website and. Two Blu-rays that I ordered from Criterion earlier this week, and they came today. And some Blu-rays that I got from Kino Lorber Studio Classics. So, yeah. So, this one's going to be a... So, the, so yeah. So, yep. So, anyways, here's my Criterion Collection and Kino Lorber Studio Classics DVD, Blu-ray, and 4K Ultra HD disc update. So, yep. So, Yeah. Let's get this started. First, we're going to start with the three Criterion DVDs and Blu-rays I have. This first one's a DVD, Criterion DVD. This one I pre-ordered. I pre-ordered back in February of this this year. And I got this last Saturday, um, a few days before its release date, which was May 18th. So, so this is the second time that I got something early, an early Criterion Blu-ray DVD. The other one was Hollywood Shuffle. And this one is a movie that movie that I already had on DVD, which is the original 2003 Paramount DVD. But since Criterion was coming out with this, I decided to pre-order this DVD copy and replace my other copy. The side number is one is one thousand one hundred seventy nine. This is a Paramount film from 1968. I did watch this movie. It, it was actually really cool. It was actually it's actually a pretty cool thriller film. If you haven't heard or seen this movie before, And here are the two Criterion Blu-rays that I have. Um, these two I ordered on Wednesday from their website, and they came in today. And basically, Criterion was having another um, Memorial Memorial Day um, May sale, which this one, the sale ends on May 29th on their website. Pretty much get 30% off on all their on the, all their Blu-rays, DVDs, and 4K discs. So I ordered... Um, two Blu-rays from there, so, yep, and here they are, and both of these are foreign films with, with, with English subtitles, this one, the side number is six, is 665, This one's in Dan is in Danish, French, and Swedish this language with English subtitles. And this one won the best for this one won the Oscar for best foreign film of 1987. And this movie was released here in America by Orion Classics. And I do want to check this movie out, so finally have in my collection. This one comes in a really cool slip box. And if you're wondering, I have the windows open in this room.
And here's the last and other Criterion Blu-ray that I have in this update. And this one's a Blu-ray and DVD combo pack. The side number is 682. This one's in Italian with English subtitles, and this one also won. This one is another. This is another foreign film that won the best, won the Oscar for best foreign film of 1970, and it was actually released here in America by Columbia Pictures, which is pretty interesting. Here's the Blu-ray disc, and here's the DVD copy. Here's disc one and disc two, and the back of the artwork is just blank. So that's it for the Criterions. Now let's get on to the Kino Lorbert Studio Classics Blu-rays I have in this update, which I have nine, which I have nine Blu-rays and one 4K Ultra HD and Blu-ray disc combo pack to show. And all these I got from Kino Lorbert's Studio, Kino Lorbert Studio Classics website. And some of these I pre-ordered while there was there's four of them that I got from their sale that was still going on in April which I didn't show you because I was busy with some stuff, but here they are. And this first one, this first one was one of three that I pre-ordered. This movie is released by Vestron Pictures, but this this but it's now owned by Lionsgate. This one has two cuts to film, the director's cut and the theatrical cut. Now this next one is one of is is one of five is one of five movies that I had on DVD by Psychic on Blu-ray, which which Kino Lober released it from their Studio Classics collection. This is one of them. Nineteen sixty two Paramount film. This next one is a is another movie that I didn't have in my collection. And if you hear that noise, that's just my dad mowing the lawn outside. Columbia Pictures movie from 1948. 
And this one actually has two reversible covers. This one, I wanted this one because it's memorable in my opinion. This is the other reversible cover. And I had heard good things about this movie, so why not pick this up? Once again, I have this movie on DVD, but why not get this one on Blu-ray? This one's a French movie with English subtitles, and this one was released by Paramount Classics. Once again, this one is another movie that I had on DVD, which was the Kino Lorber Studio Classics DVD release, but I decided to get this one on Blu-ray because this one has a new... 4K remastered, and this one has a commentary on it. And this next one, um, this one I got in the mail yesterday. This one's a surprise because this blurry does not come out until um, Tuesday the 23rd of this month. But I got this one early, so yep. This one's the 1957 of version of My Man Godfrey. I had the 1936 movie on version on Blu-ray, which is from Criterion. Well, this one's the 1957 version. This movie is produced by Stone Group Pictures and is owned by MGM, but this movie is actually released by Columbia Pictures back in Nighttime 1, and this Blu-ray actually has the, the film's original Columbia logo at the beginning of this movie. This Blu-ray copy, believe it or not. And this movie was previously released on Blu-ray and DVD by, by All of Films, but All of Films is no longer a business, so Kino Lorber re-released this one, and this one has a reversible cover. And by the way, Marty is a United Artists movie. Here's the last Blu-ray that I have that's from Kino Lorber Studio Classics that's in this update. 
This movie I already, this movie I did move, I had this movie on DVD, but it was all scratched, so why not get this one on Blu-ray? This one's released by Polygram Films. And here's the one 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray disc that I have that's from Kino Lower Studio Classics. My first Kino Lower 4K Ultra HD disc that I have. This one, once again, I have on DVD, but I saw I get this one on Blu-ray, which this one was the 4K Blu-ray combo pack. This is the original Italian job from 1969. And this one also has a reversible cover. Here's the 4K disc and the Blu-ray disc. Now, let me get into detail about how I got these Kino Lober titles. Now, the Italian job, Usual suspects, suspe suspects, Marty and Lady from Shanghai, I got from there when they were still having their March sale. And, and, and Hell is for Heroes, Man on the Train, and The Longest Yard. I pre-ordered these three titles. It was back probably um in March or April. And basically I got, I basically got them when The Longest Yard was, I believe The Longest Yard came out on Blu-ray this, this two, um, earlier this this Tuesday and I got gone fr got my package on Friday and and also that month I pre-ordered three other Kino Lover Blu-rays which were Backtrack um Stone Cold and My Man Godfrey which came which came which also came on last last night which is Friday so that's why I got this one early so yep if you're curious, I also, um, and I've also pre-ordered three more Kino Lober titles from their website, their Studio Classics website, which are Superco on 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray disc, um, Joy House on DVD, and, and, and Heat, the 1986 one with Burt Reynolds, which that one should arrive when Joy House will be released on DVD and Blu-ray um probably next the next Tuesday so yep so yeah so yeah so that's it for my Criterion DVD Blu-ray and Kino Lover Blu-ray and 4K Ultra HD update and and for my other update I'm going to do tomorrow which which I will explain of how why side my why I'm excited to do this my this my update like this this weekend in a different type of way. So yep. And I have some more movies that I got that during the past two weeks which I'll show tomorrow in my next update. So yep. So hope you guys like this update for today and see you guys later tomorrow for my next update. So yep, peace out.